Hello friends, welcome to this session of data visualization with R and ggplot2. In this video, we will learn how to order bars of bar plot in descending or ascending order. Bar plot is used to compare different categories based on their numeric values. Here, in this example, we want to compare performance of students of a class in five different subjects. But if the bars are not ordered as per their numeric values, it becomes difficult to understand which category is the best or which is the worst. Ordering in ascending or descending order makes it easy to know this. I have created the data for a class of 20 students. Subject vector is obtained by repeating five letters A to E 20 times using ref function and each argument. Scores in a subject is obtained by using rnorm function to get 20 numbers with a mean and standard deviation. This function was repeated 5 times changing mean and sd each time. The data is rounded to get integer scores using round function. These two vectors are stored in a data frame df because ggplot2 require data frame as input. I have summarized the data using group by and summarize function from deployer package of tidyverse universe. Group by function makes groups of students of the five subjects and summarize function using mean and sd calculates mean and standard deviation for each subject. Mean will be used to plot bars and sd will be used to add error bars. This is the basic bar plot plotted using ggplot function of ggplot2 package. I have called the library ggplot2 to get ggplot function. Please note that I have used stat identity as argument to geombar. This will plot the values from data table and not counts of the values. Fill subject is added to AES argument of ggplot to color the bars as per the subject. Geom error bar has been added to the plot to get error bars. In AES argument of geom error bar, y mean is specified as mean minus sd and y max as mean plus sd. Width of error bar has been specified as 0.2. I have changed the default theme to theme underscore classic to get classic plot. It looks good. You can use the theme you want or the theme prescribed by your mentor or journal. Here, legend is redundant because the same information is conveyed by x-axis. I have removed the legend by adding theme legend.position is equal to none to the plot code. Legend has disappeared. If you look at the bars of this plot, you can see that bars are not arranged ascendingly or descendingly. We will modify the code just a little to arrange these bars. I will add here reorder put the bracket and after subject because I want to order the subject and I want to order it according to mean the numeric variable which will give heights of the bars and I have added that completed the bracket and then comma this reorder in bracket subject comma mean acts as x-axis and this mean will act as y-axis and will provide heights to the bar. We will run that. Now you can see the bars got arranged ascendingly. And to make those descending, just add the negative side in front of the numeric variable in reorder option. I will run this. And now bars got arranged descendingly. This is a very simple way to arrange the bars in your bar plot. Thank you for watching the video. If you have liked it, please click the like button, share with your friends and please subscribe to my channel if you have not subscribed it yet. Thank you again.